Yo guys, what's going on? Welcome back to a brand new video of WWE Supercard Season 4, Episode Number 42. Today, guys, we have got new kind of update that came to the game yesterday, and I'm only doing this now. Very sorry about that, guys, but yes, Valentine's Day themed cards are out, just like the Halloween. It's literally the exact same thing, just with candy hearts and stuff like that or themed for Valentine's Day so not a much not much difference that I can see for now from the Halloween stuff and you're not familiar with the Halloween stuff then from the board from packs ticket packs battleground packs king of the ring rewards everything you can imagine you have a chance to get hardened to titan Valentine themed uh, well, these cards basically from hardened to elite sorry from hardened to titan Obviously, the packs is the best thing because that's where you'll get, and that's where you'll get the majority of them from. If you're if you're just expecting to get some titans and stuff, stuff like that from the board, you uh, you might you might you might um, still be here in, in like a couple months time. Not that the event will last that long, but don't expect many pulls off the board. If you did, obviously, awesome, you're very lucky. But don't expect too much from there. We do have a background pack in an hour. This it will be in this video. But for now, guys, the main thing is these packs right here and also a little bit of progress on the ring domination of course in the last video we did unlock the heroic ring domination i have now completed adam cole um and we're currently working on the cesaro the titan um also don't forget guys the beast is titus o'neill if you need titus o'neill for your fusion make sure you guys go collect him i've got one day 15 hours left on my fusion until we can um, well look at what if I can start slotting some things in it. Obviously, I'm still missing AJ, Sasha, and TJ. The main ones I will need. Um, the main ones, well, or oh, they're all main, but the ones I don't have and the ones that I'm obviously looking for. Um, that's what I'm doing in King of the Ring. I'm trying my very best in King of the Ring to make to make it to the quarters. I my goal is to lose in the quarterfinals. And I'm getting two beast cards, obviously hoping for TJ and Sasha Banks. So gonna keep these um, these King of the Rings running non-stop throughout the next two weeks with the Nakamura. Um, should we get into candy art packs or should we play a game of ringdom? How's my card total looking at? Let's play one game and uh, hopefully get a shard or something like that. And then we're gonna go and attempt uh, one of those candy. I don't know what they're actually called. I have to look at them because uh, I'm gonna be referring. Uh, to them a lot. I need to know the name of them. Also guys, Goldberg who have chucked in the uh, Heroic RD. Very useful actually now that you're doing two events. You can, once you do get it, put it in and uh, and get that level up. So that is pretty good. Pretty cool. And he's almost done to be honest. He's got about eight more games left to do in power. Sorry, in tough. It's in charisma and then about two or three left in power. And then he is done. Obviously, wait until we get the heroic on to pro him, but we'll be able to pro him straight away, which will be really cool. Hopefully, chuck him in a King of the Ring as well, give me that extra boost um, to, to do good in King of the Rings. Obviously, I don't want to do too well because I don't want to make it um, further than the uh, the quarterfinals. Because I mean, I'd still get one beast, so I wouldn't be the, the end of the world if if I did, but. The chances of me winning a King of the Ring are quite slim, okay? So from the quarters, you have to win the quarters, you have to win the semis, and then you have to win the final, which I'm definitely not guaranteed to do. And everything below that, that it gives me monster cards, and I don't I don't need monster cards at all. So I've got, I got my Star Rally, I've got Samoa Joe, we've got what we need monster-wise in the, for the Nakamura Fusion. The Beast, Beast is where we got the problem, of course. It really does suck. If, if only I'd have known, of course, everyone is saying that who's already had TJ and um, TJ PL precise, not 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 Tyson Kidd as in TJ. Hey, we actually did get a shard. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Shard luck on uh, on YouTube. On camera is awful. On stream it's decent. It's really decent on stream most of the time, but when I'm recording, just, no. And it's not often that I'm recording when uh, we got a full card like this. It's normally at the end of the card. But yeah, there we go, guys. We did one game. We're going to go and try our luck with the pack. I'm expecting like two, three Hardens. May may maybe if I'm lucky, um, <laughs> a WrestleMania heart or something. I do have one heart. I'm not going to go crazy on these like I did with the Halloween. I, I don't. I, I love collecting images. That is a big thing I like doing. But. I'm not. I don't. I don't really care beyond that because 
I'm not going to get myself a Titan Pro unless unless I get insanely lucky. But yeah, the the pumpkins were definitely better than Harden to Titan. It was much better ratio. So this it's not it's not filling me uh, with confidence because um, obviously I did try those Royal Rumble packs. But anyway, let's do it without any further ado. Please just give me something decent. An ultimate. Okay, I see two Hardens there. Um, a SummerSlam 17. Woohoo! <laughs> Okay, and there it is. There is the SummerSlam 17. Highest rated card we get in there. Two Hardens, two Ultimates, and a SummerSlam 17. So I actually got better than what I was expecting. So yay me, I suppose. Um, I'm just going to give you a quick up-to-date up to look at how we're doing in the Royal Rumble with three and a half days left. I'm still top of my league. I'm actually trying in this PvP cycle. Three momentum slots for me, I think I would be more than happy with. Um, but I, I, I think I could probably get myself to four momentum slots. I don't know how much I want four momentum slots if it's worth really going all out. Because the packs, we all know how trash they are and how useless they are. And CP wise, it looks like I will get the max of 1,500 CP for being first in my league. Um, so if, if we do just leave it on three momentum slots, then three momentum slots. But if I can get four, plus um, obviously Goldberg uh, with both, both uh, heroics. Um, yeah, I, I would have a pretty nice deck. Now, r Money in the Bank, guys. The new cards are in. We'll have a quick look at them. Um, I know they were in probably last uh, last episode at the end, but here they are properly. Now, the card design is horrible. We can all agree on that. It looks dreadful. It's lazy. It's just a red filter on top of it. It's horrible. Um, that said... That said, if you are not getting these cards because of how horrible they look, just know that when you change the image, it doesn't have the horrible red filter. It actually looks rather nice, to be totally honest. Um, I've seen a couple of images, people were claiming the Oscar using another image, and obviously the, 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 the rest of the card will still be red, of course, but the whole Oscar itself doesn't have the red filter, it has the other image. So that, it, looks, it, looks, it, looks, it looks fairly nice, it makes up for it just a little bit. When you make, um, well, I, I think it actually does look quite sick, to be totally honest, with um, not this image of Asker on the card. But all of it together, no, n not a good job, Supercard, not a good job. Um, almost at 8,000 contracts, 22,000 contracts for a single. M not looking very likely in the 26 days I have for it. I'm going to just get some contracts, keep playing this mode, try and grind my way up to like 20 something K. Um, hopefully by the end of the cycle, uh, maybe even a bit more, and then I'll decide then and then if I go for the Asuka um, in a couple days, I'll get, I'll get what else I need, really go for it. I'm just going to slowly get up to like 20, 30k, and then if I do decide to go for Asuka, we'll do like a long stream, two days running or something, where we just money in the bank, grind session, and, uh, and we go and get Asuka, because... The more I think about it, obviously, Asuka would be a great addition to my deck. Even eventually, if I get some female Titan Bros, they're not going to be as good as Asuka. And the way my female luck has been going recently, it's not looking very promising. That said, I do need to update my last pull. We do have a, uh, a new pull. And, speaking of females, yes guys, we did it, finally, since Lisa, obviously, but, I mean, yes. Yes, my collection of single females grows a tiny bit more with the addition of Carmella, Miss Money in the Bank. Um, so I'll have to update that instead of Van Dango for the next segment, next little part of this video. That will be up to date and I'll have a platinum pack for you guys. So stay tuned and I'll see you guys in just a couple seconds. It's time guys for the platinum pack. I've literally been here sitting at my computer just waiting 3 a.m. almost no sorry no it's not 3 a.m. well it is but it is um, almost 4 a.m. guys and I am knackered but I wanted to get this platinum pack done now and talk to you guys once more about a couple things and I did a cheeky little um, 600 credit pack of camera as soon as I did recording just for the lols just for the pants and yeah <laughs> we um, we actually got something rather decent 
Um, and if, uh, well, there we go, spoiler, it's a monster. <laughs> so yeah, second best tier obviously you can get for these arts. And there it is. Obviously that would indicate, ah, oh, Fimbala maybe, but that's not how they've done it for some stupid reason. That'd be, that'd be too, it'd be too simple to do that, wouldn't it? Too, see what I there? Um, <laughs> but no, that doesn't obviously, that doesn't mean it's Fimbala at all. Um, the too sweet, but it'd be cool if, it, if that was like guaranteed Fimbala. Um, so yeah, that is that is a bit of news there. A little bit of news as well, of course. Um, as soon as you get the the hearts, they will go to your star rating, and you'll keep the image in the catalog. Because I had an elite one that I got from a ticket pack, forgetting obviously that I got it. I trained it away because unlike it was at the beginning, the pumpkins that I think were the same. If you did select all, they'd train away, and then I think they released a little update where if you did, they wouldn't train away. Um, they need to do the same thing with these these Valentine things because I've already trained that elite one away. Not too heartbreaking. Um, so now I know I've locked all the other ones in. We're going to get into this platinum pack without any further ado. I am obviously, obviously looking for TJ Perkins Beast, Sasha Banks Beast, or any hearts we can get. Okay, I saw someone on Twitter get a goddamn Titan heart. Um, Valentine thing and a, a monster Mustafa Ali. Not that I would need a Mustafa Ali, but that's insane luck. Titan Candy Heart and um, something you need for the Nakamura. Another decent win against this team. Uh, almost 12,000 to 6,000. Uh, let's go and claim our rewards. Come on. Come on. Give me some luck, Supercard. There's a Titan in it. Come on. Right, there's no beast, so no Sasha Banks, no nothing that we would want uh, on that level. But it can still be good, I, I believe. No! <laughs> Luke Gallows. Oh man, but 40,000 CP, that's not too bad. Hey, I mean. Best possible pack you get. I've got something in my eye. Brilliant. Uh, best possible pack you. Oh no, no. Best possible pack you can get. Um, rewards wise, it could have been a hell of a lot better though. You know, I would have obviously taken two beasts and a monster if it would have meant I don't know TJP or Sasha. But hey, uh, I'm Luke Gallows is a pro. I don't know. Corbin's definitely not. I've already pro Corbin. Not too sure about Kofi. We'll have to see. Platinum pack's done now, all of that wait for not much in return. The good news is that I'm, I don't want to don't get too excited, but I am 2-0 up against this uh, Krizov guy. Obviously, game 2 is uh, is going to go to me, they're already 3-0 up, he hasn't charged. So I'm really praying he doesn't charge for the next one. And that way, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm good, straight, straight to that quarterfinal. And hopefully we lose in the quarterfinals. Um, we're going to start another battleground as soon as that starts. Ring Dom, no, um, no progress. But I do want to show you guys something really weird. And it, and it entails me playing a game of Money in the Bank to show you what's been going on. I just noticed this while I, was, as I, said, while I said I was sitting here. Just waiting for the Platinum Pack. I noticed something really strange. And I hope it doesn't not do it now that I'm recording. But it, it said I had a bout. I used that bout. Okay, uh, and then literally I came, I come, I came back. I come back, and there's another. I've got another bout. The timer was still counting down. I did it again. All right, finished the game, and then got back to that screen, and I had another bout. So it's going to be very interesting to see. You guys saw there was 53 minutes left until I get the free bout. Um, so technically, once I've played this game, that should be it. I shouldn't have another bout for Money in the Bank. Now I'm going to look like a complete idiot if um, if it doesn't work. And, uh, and just for people, I'm, I'm not going to title the video like, Oh my god, huge money in the bank glitch. I could, but I'm not going to. Um, just because, you know what, I, I want to I take the, the, the higher road on YouTube from now on. No, uh, n it's not clickbait, because if, if, if this works, it, it would, it's true, isn't it? But no, it's really weird, and I hope this stays. God, that'd be a miracle if this... Uh, if this date again, I'm gonna look like an idiot. If it, if it obviously it just it, uh, as maybe when I backed out from the page, it stopped doing it. You know, who knows? But I give you guys my word. I did uh, I did about four bouts. Um, 
back to back when it said I had one left, used it, came back, still had that one bout left, used it, came back, still had it left. Really, really strange. Um, I'm really praying it works, just so you guys can see it. More than, you know, more than anything, just so you guys can see that I'm not, I'm not crazy. Uh, here we go. Will it? Will, will, will we? Will... Nope. Okay. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm just really hoping that one of you guys have experienced it yourselves, so you know that I'm not. I'm telling the truth. Um, I, I did obviously back out to go open my platinum pack, start recording the episode. That mo that must have triggered it. It might have just been just, I don't know, some kind of some kind of small little glitch. Um, should have should have should have <laughs> should have used it more. Um, but yeah. Anyway, sorry for wasting you guys this time on that money in the bank game. But that I think for now is going to be it, guys. Um, for the episode, if not, I'll bring you guys back for a tiny little extra segment, maybe King Ring rewards, maybe getting the Cesaro finale will be in the next episode, guys. Thank you for watching. Maybe I'll see you in a bit. If not, take care. Peace out.